Molly Kathleen Ringwald, born February 18, 1968, is an American actress, singer, and author. She was cast in her first major role as Molly in the NBC sitcom The Facts of Life, 1979-80, after a casting director saw her playing an orphan in a stage production of the musical Annie. She and several other members of the original Facts of Life cast were let go when the show was reworked by the network. She subsequently made her motion picture debut in the independent film Tempest, 1982, which earned her a Golden Globe nomination for New Star of the Year. Ringwald is known for her collaborations with filmmaker John Hughes, having appeared in three of his films. After appearing in the successful Hughes films Sixteen Candles, 1984, The Breakfast Club, 1985, and Pretty in Pink, 1986, Ringwald became a teen icon. She later starred in The Pickup Artist, 1987, Fresh Horses, 1988, and For Keeps, 1988. She starred in many films in the 1990s, most notably Something to Live For, The Allison Gert Story, 1992, The Stand, 1994, and some folks call it a Sling Blade, 1994 short film precursor to Sling Blade. Ringwald is part of the Brat Pack, and she was ranked number one on VH1's 100 Greatest Teen Stars. Since 2017, Ringwald has portrayed Mary Andrews on the CW television series Riverdale. Early life Ringwald was born in Roseville, California, the daughter of Adele Edith, Nay Fremd, a housewife and chef, and Robert Scott, Bob Ringwald, a jazz pianist who is blind. Ringwald has two siblings, Beth and Kelly, and an older brother who died before she was born. She started her acting career at age five, appearing in a stage production of Alice in Wonderland as the Dormouse. The next year, she recorded I Wanna Be Loved By You, a music album of Dixieland jazz with her father and his group, the Fulton Street Jazz Band. Ringwald graduated from the Lycée Francais de Los Angeles. Life and career, 1978 to 83, career beginnings. In 1978, at the age of 10, Ringwald was chosen to play Kate in the West Coast production of Annie, performing in Los Angeles and 1979, Ringwald appeared on the TV series Different Strokes and was selected to become part of a very large cast of that show's spin-off The Facts of Life. She played Molly Parker, a perky, feminist student at Eastland Girls School. At the beginning of the second season, the show underwent a major revamp and most of the cast, including Ringwald, were cut from the show. Ringwald later said that Nancy McKeon replaced her to play a new character named Joe. In 1980, Ringwald performed as a lead vocalist on two Disney albums. On the patriotic album Yankee Doodle Mickey, Ringwald sang, This is my country, The Star Spangled Banner, and God Bless America. She later performed one track, The First Noel, on a Disney Christmas album, Disney's Merry Christmas Carols. Turning toward motion pictures, she got a key supporting role in the 1982 film Tempest. Directed by Paul Mazursky with top casting director Juliette Taylor, and was subsequently nominated for a Golden Globe Award for the role. 1984 to 89, 16 Candles, The Breakfast Club, Pretty in Pink, and Early Success. Ringwald rose to prominence with her breakout role in 16 Candles. 1984, she was cast as Samantha Baker, a girl whose 16th birthday is forgotten by her family. Ringwald's performance gained critical acclaim. Many called her acting engaging. Ringwald would later say, It is not a good idea to do remakes of great classic films, when asked if there would be a remake to Sixteen Candles. Ringwald was regarded as a member of the so-called Brat Pack of 1980s teen actors, but has said she was not really part of that group. Ringwald gained more success when she was cast in another John Hughes film, The Breakfast Club, 1985, which was a commercial and critical success. Ringwald was cast as Claire Standish, a spoiled, rich, so-called sophisticate who is in detention for skipping class to go shopping. Ringwald's performance gained strong reviews. The following year, still in high school, she was cast as Andy Walsh in another successful Hughes film, Pretty in Pink, 1986. Ringwald's role as Andy went on to become one of her most recognizable performances. When first asked to be in Pretty in Pink, Ringwald was reluctant, but after seeing how hard it was for the producers to find a replacement for her, she decided she would portray Andy in the film. 
Ringwald was offered a role in another John Hughes film, Some Kind of Wonderful, 1987, but turned down the role as she felt it was too similar to the other films she worked on with Hughes. After Pretty in Pink, Ringwald planned to star in more mature roles. Ringwald was later featured on the cover of the May 26, 1986 issue of Time magazine. Ringwald was set to star in another Hughes film, Oil and Vinegar, but the film was scrapped when Hughes refused to rewrite the script. The film would have been about a soon-to-be-married man and a hitchhiking girl talking about their lives during the length of a car ride that I in 1987. She was cast as Randy Jensen in The Pickup Artist opposite Robert Downey, Jr. in one of his first lead roles. It focused on a womanizer who meets his match when he falls for a woman in debt to the mafia. The pickup artist was met with mixed reviews while being a moderate commercial success. The following year she starred in For Keeps, a commercial success that received mixed reviews from critics but was well received by audiences. It is considered Ringwald's final teen movie. Ringwald portrayed Darcy Elliott, the editor at her high school paper, who becomes pregnant by her long-term boyfriend Stan, portrayed by Randall Badenkoff. Her performance received positive reviews. The film was praised by some critics for showing the struggles of teen pregnancy. She was later cast in Fresh Horses. The film was met with generally negative reviews and underperformed at the box office. The film also starred Andrew McCarthy, who previously worked with Ringwald in Pretty in Pink, 1990s, 2010s. The Stand and Continued Acting in the early 1990s, Ringwald reportedly turned down the female lead roles in Pretty Woman and Ghost. In the mid-1990s, Ringwald, who had been educated at the Lycée Francais de Los Angeles and is fluent in French, moved to Paris and starred in several French movies. She returned to the United States intermittently to appear in American movies and television. In 1990, Ringwald appeared in the James Scott-directed Strike It Rich alongside Robert Lindsay and John Gielgud. That same year she starred in Betsy's Wedding as Betsy Hopper. This film gained generally mixed reviews despite being a commercial success. Ringwald later starred in Something to Live For, The Allison Gert Story, 1992. In 1994, she was cast as Franny Goldsmith in the TV adaptation of Stephen King's The Stand. Ringwald's performance was generally well received. She next played the leading role in the film Malicious, 1995, as Melissa Nelson, a disturbed woman who has an affair with a college star baseball player. She later starred in the ABC sitcom Townies. She also made one appearance as a blind woman on the critically acclaimed cable series Remember WENN. She starred with Laura Flynn Boyle and Terry Hatcher in the 1998 made-for-television film Since You've Been Gone. In 1999, she played the starring role of Lil Bit in 2000, in Vogel's play Ringwald How I Learned to Drive the Ensemble at the Mark Restaurant Forum film in Los in Angeles. In, and 2000, in 2001, she had she a cameo appeared in an the episode of Showtime's Not Outer Another Limits, Teen Movie that earned Judgment an MTV Day. Movie Award nomination. In theater, she wore a green, green dress in Jonathan Larson's off-Broadway musical Tick, Tick, Boom, and headlined as Sally Bowles in Broadway's long-running revival of Cabaret from December 18, 2001 until April 28, 2002. In 2003, Ringwald appeared in Enchanted April on Broadway beginning April 8, but left after the performance of June 15 due to her pregnancy with her daughter. In late 2004, she starred in the play Modern Orthodox on Broadway, opposite Jason Biggs and Craig Bierko. In 2006, she starred in the television film The Wives He Forgot, and that fall and winter starred as Charity Hope Valentine in the national tour of the Broadway revival of the musical Sweet Charity. She also played a supporting role as Molly McIntyre's mother Helen in Molly, an American girl on the home front. Ringwald starred in the ABC Family Network series The Secret Life of the American Teenager, which debuted on July 1, 2008 and ran for five seasons and 121 episodes, before ending on June 3, 2013. She played and Jurgens, the title teenager's mother. Ringwald read the audiobook edition of the 2012 novel The Middlesteins by Jamie Attenberg. 2013 present. Except Sometimes and Riverdale. In early 2013, Ringwald released Except Sometimes, a jazz record. It follows a tradition in jazz for the Ringwald family set by her father. I grew up in a home filled with music and had an early appreciation of jazz, since my dad was a jazz musician. 
Beginning at around age three, I started singing with his band and jazz music has continued to be one of my three passions along with acting and writing. I like to say jazz music is my musical equivalent of comfort food. It's always where I go back to when I want to feel grounded, Ringwald said in a statement. Ringwald played Madame Fréchette in the 2014 Lifetime Christmas film Wishin' and Hopin'. Ringwald plays Aunt Bailey in Gem and the Holograms, Raising Jerrica, her sister Kimber, and adopted daughters in September 2014. Ringwald began writing an advice column for The Guardian, answering questions about love, family, or life in general. In 2016, she was cast as Amy in the crime drama film King Cobra. Ringwald currently has a recurring role as Mary Andrews on the CW television series Riverdale. In 2019 Ringwald made her debut as a translator, providing the English translation of the French novel Lie With Me by Philippe Besson. Personal Life Ringwald married Valérie Leminer, a French writer, in Bordeaux, France, on July 28, 1999. They divorced in 2002. She married Panio Giannopoulos, a Greek-American writer and book editor, in 2007. They have a daughter, born in 2003, and fraternal boy-girl twins, born in July 2009. Her pregnancy was written into the storyline of the secret life of the American teenager. She was the subject of an episode in season seven of the genealogy series, Who Do You Think You Are? Public Image. Ringwald has stated that she was very aware of her public image during her teen years and that she tried to be a good role model for her fans. When asked about For Keeps, 1988, Ringwald said, I didn't want to give the wrong message to teenagers. I sort of felt a certain responsibility. I mean, I was a very, very famous teenager and I thought a lot of teenagers were looking up to me and emulating me. And I really didn't want to make a movie that said in any way that having a baby at that age was going to be easy. Real name Molly Kathleen Ringwald. Nickname N.A. Profession singer, writer, actress, dancer, spouse Giannopoulos Panio. Children Zarini Roman Adele. Date of birth February 18, 1968. Age 56 years. Zodiac sign Aquarius. Birthplace Roseville, California U.S. Residence Roseville, California U.S. Nationality American. Ethnicity American. Parents' father name Robert Ringwald. Mother name Adele Edith Fremd. Siblings Beth and Kelly. Alma Mater School name Eastland Girls School. College name Roseville High School. Height 5 feet 8 inches. Weight 60 kilograms. Molly Ringwald's family. Molly Ringwald married Mr. Bailery Laminier. 1999 to 2002. After she marries Mr. Giannopoulos Panio in 2007. He is a writer. Molly Ringwald has three children named are Matilda Arini Giannopoulos, Roman Stilianos Giannopoulos, and Adele Georgiana Giannopoulos. Molly Ringwald's parents. Mrs. Adele Edith Fremd and Mr. Robert Ringwald gave birth to Molly Ringwald. 